morning guys so i tried to vlog yesterday but i'm pretty sure it was a fail because it rained all day and we basically stayed inside all day so i'm pretty sure yesterday's vlog was a fail but today is november 20th it's monday i have to leave for work in about 30 minutes we just got home from the grocery store she's having a little snack but i'm going to feed her we're both actually going to have lunch i can't breathe because i feel I can't breathe because I just carried all my groceries in, in one trip. So this is all that I got. We did go to Walmart today. Like I've mentioned several times in past vlogs, the Aldi's in my town is closed. I really want it to open. I think it's going to open in like two more weeks. But this is like my first time. Well, my last grocery trip was my first time going to the grocery store to like buy for us to eat every meal all week and I've never really done that before like when I lived with my parents they obviously still fed us like dinner and stuff so I'm still kind of learning like what to buy and what I need but this was my second trip and I think I did a little better this time than I did the first time I did spend a little more than my budget because my budget I'll say it it's $50 a week on groceries and I'm gonna buy my groceries weekly I did spend about $62 I think it was what was my no, it was $67 actually, $67.12. So I did go a little bit over, but I did get some things that I wouldn't get every trip, like croutons, sour creams, like stuff like that, that you don't get every week when you go to the grocery store. So Grayson's throwing her food everywhere right now. Why are you doing that? Huh? Why are you doing that? You don't like your turkey sandwich I made you? No? Okay basically just gonna start over here I just got cranberry grape juice cocktail I, I mostly drink this Grayson doesn't drink this I drink this and then I just got a Pepsi this is obviously for me your girl cannot live without her caffeine so don't judge I just got this thin crust three meat pizza it's just like a frozen pizza I thought we could have this for dinner for dinner one night a giant thing of blueberry waffles this should last us quite some time so I was buying like these ones that are in here these like smaller packs right here but we go through these so quick and these are the fit and active the whole wheat ones and I hate these Grace won't eat these but I don't like the whole wheat but I just got like a big thing of the great value blueberry waffles and you guys will see a lot of the great value brand um, because it's cheaper chicken breast strips for lunch and dinners seasoned french fried potatoes these two frozen meals which i usually i take these to work got the honey glazed turkey and potatoes and then the beef teriyaki these are just super easy to just take to work and throw in the microwave a thing of cuties flour tortillas for like tacos if we have tacos or if we just have like cheese roll-ups or something grace one loves cheese roll-ups so graduates fruit and veggie melts from Gerber. I also got her her favorite little crunchy mild cheddar baby Cheetos. Chocolate pudding snack packs. These are mostly for me, but I don't know. Grayson's never had these, so I don't even know if she likes them. I got the original potato chips from Great Value. I've never tried these. I hope I like them. Two cans of soup. Um, I just got like chicken wild rice soup and then like beef with vegetable those are for mostly me a thing of sour cream i got the flavor blasted goldfish we love those i got the schwabel's giant loaf of bread <laughs> these are the best pickles on the planet and i know that this is one of abby's biggest pregnancy cravings so sorry if i make you crave pickles girl but i just got the kosher dill clausen halves these are so freaking good these were actually when i was pregnant with graceland i craved these like a mofo two avocados because you know avocados are life croutons uh, these are just like the caesar croutons to go with obviously i got a head of lettuce and then i got this caesar dressing mesquite mesquite smoked turkey breast it's my favorite kind and then i got the moonster monster i don't even know how you say this deli sliced cheese and then I also got some mozzarella string cheese. I got a thing of bananas. And then I just got this cinnamon crunch cereal for breakfast. So yeah, that is for, I think it's for the week. Maybe this will last longer than a week. I don't know. I'm new at this, so I'm still figuring it out. I mean, we obviously have food in the fridge already, but we needed more food for this week. I'm just gonna eat really quick because I have to leave now in what, 20 minutes? So I'm going to eat really quick and then I'm gonna head out the door to go drop her off at Jima's house. Peekaboo! Peekaboo! And as you guys can see, I still have not figured my dining room out because my dining room table is going to make me shave my entire head. 
we're ready to go to Jima's house. Look at that sun in your eyeballs, baby. Good thing I have those shades. We're gonna put those shades on when we get to Jima's house so the sun's not in your eyes, okay? Can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. <laughs> we are at my parents' right now and Grislin is about to throw a little fit because that's just what she does when I park the car. But um, it's super, super, super bright out today. For like the past couple days, it hasn't been like super bright. I finally had to like whip out my sunglasses because it was so gloomy, as you can see by my past couple vlogs. The weather outside was just so, so gloomy. Poor Graceland back there is like being drenched in the sun. She just sneezed. I don't know if you heard her, but. Oh, bless you, baby. Is the sun making you sneeze? Yeah. I don't know if it drives anyone else crazy when like the sun's in your baby's eyes, but it drives me absolutely insane. A while ago, I bought her a um, like a shaded window thingy with like suction cups on it, and it sucked like so bad. I bought it for her for Christmas. If you guys watched my baby, what my baby got for Christmas last year, I showed it in that video and that thing literally never stayed on the window like ever so it pretty much was just a waste of what i think it was like five bucks or something i did get in contact with this company and they are called i'm not really sure how you pronounce it it's my p-a-p-o-o-s-e and they sell these um car side window like sunshades obviously for the window um you do get like a three pack in them and they sent these to me and i'm going to go ahead and try them out for the first time today the cool thing about these is they obviously protect against the uv rays the heat and then just the sun from coming into the window in general but i really really like these because you don't need suction cups or adhesive which i'm very like intrigued to see how these work because all the ones i ever see like at walmart or target or babies R Us or anywhere they're all suction cup or like adhesive and those ones never seem to work okay so here's my poor baby with the sun look at that sun in her face i'm just going to try them out right now for the first time Oop. Whoop. so the cool thing about this whole set that you get is it comes with this little like bonus pouch where you can just tuck these away if you're not using them or if you just want to take them off or something or when you get them it's nice because they come in this little like cool cute compact pouch and then you open it and you have all of the um, shades and the cool thing about these is how they actually work they're a double layered mesh so on one side it's like the plasticky material and then on the other side it's like the mesh material and these actually block out all the sun rays and any of the glares without like messing up the view of the window like you can actually see out the window with the sun the static layer right here this is gonna cling to the window and it will make this stay right in place so Wow, this actually sticks like super good. The static this is them sticking and it really does block out like a lot of the sun. Like if I look up right now, that's the sun right there and you can see that's totally blocking like the whole entire sun out. Basically when you're done, you want to take it down, you just peel it off, which is so neat. And these totally stick, like they stick so good. Look at how good that this is sticking right now. I had to take this little girl out of her seat because she was like losing her mind over here. But if you guys are looking for like a baby shower gift or a gift to a mother in general, or just looking for yourself and you're a mom yourself, that is like a perfect thing to get because nobody wants their baby to be in the car in the back seat with the sun glaring on them for hours. Like I know I wish I would have had these when I went on our trip to Virginia because it really would have come in handy because we went in July or actually we went in August and it was super, super sunny and I didn't have something like this. So I really wish I would have had it then so she didn't have to sit you know, in the sun for hours and hours. But if you guys are interested in purchasing these, they do sell them on Amazon. They're only at $12.97 and they do have prime they are prime eligible which i'm a prime user and if you don't have prime on amazon definitely get prime that is not sponsored by the way i just love prime so go ahead and check them out if you want to get those they are an awesome gift or they're just an awesome thing in general to get if you have children in car seats especially if your kid is rear facing and the sun is always shining in them when you are driving um it's a really good thing to purchase and invest in i guess you're not really investing because it's not a lot of money but i will have the link to buy them down below if you guys are interested now it's time to drop my little sugar off she found a ball to play with. You want to put the ball? Say woo! Woo! Let's go get Jima. Let's go find Jima, okay? Go get Gima. Go get Gima. Come on, give 
Give Mama a kiss and yeah, hug. Mama I got to go back home. Oh, wow, wow. Come on. Gima's going to clean this kisses? at the office today. Kisses? Oh. <laughs> Say I love you? Say I love you? She's like, no, I'm going to go explore Gima's house. Bye. Because I missed it. <laughs> thank you so much to my papoose or papoose. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. But thank you so much for sending me the shades. I'm so, so, so happy with them. And I'm seriously just any mother that doesn't have these already in their car. If you have kids in the car seat, definitely think about buying these. Because they are awesome. And I'm definitely glad that I have these. So, thank you. Good morning, guys. I'm leaning over my couch right now just to find out what the date is. Today is November 21st. My mom is actually on her way over right now because I want to move my dining room table into my dining room, obviously, finally. My dad finished up painting the table and the chairs for me. Thank you. Bless up to my dad. And I just have to basically get the fabric um, in the staple gun for that is my main goal today is to get the fabric but i think my mom just pulled in i did come home from work late last night i didn't get off till like well i didn't get home till like 12 30 so i moved my whole entire dining room table from my parents garage into my car why did i do it at one in the morning i don't know because i'm impatient and i just felt like i need to so i literally shoved it all into my car i have no clue how it fit in there but it somehow got in there so gma is here right now i see her out there Hey, baby girl. Hey. Tell everyone what happened to you. Well, I came to the apartment last night to put Gigi to bed. While I was at work. While I was at work. And I got out of my car and I picked G up like this. And I had a bag in my hand. And then I said, oh, better switch arms. So I did this. I got my key out of my parking and I started to go. And wham! I tripped. And I was falling. And I was like, oh, Gigi's head's going to hit the pavement. So I purposely turned my body and I fell and then Gigi and I were like this. <laughs> <laughs> but my mom has like scrapes and band-aids all that's over her. One. That's one. can see but this is my whole entire table shoved into my car I had to take out Grayson's car seat that was right here and just she obviously didn't sit in it like this but I had to just put it up here just to keep it in my car but it is like shoved in here and this right here is like a glass part that's actually super heavy so I'm gonna carry this all in right now And just like that, my little Tushi is having lunch. Um, I'm gonna try and we just actually got back from Walmart. She's having mac and cheese, some cut up grapes, and then some broccoli. I am just going to, my mom actually just left. I dropped her off here and then she had groceries, but she's going to actually come back in to help me do these seats because she thought she had a doctor's appointment, but she ended up not having a doctor's appointment at the time that she thought she had a doctor's appointment so she's going to come back in and help me do these seats so there she is at my door let me make sure it's her secret code secret code postman postman excuse me the, the secret code is true bills do you know what you're doing yes i'm using a pair of scissors they taught me this Meanwhile, Kiki's just banging away on her plate. You're probably going to dump mac and cheese on my head in about 30 seconds. You're not lying. Hey, can you eat your bites? Look at those toes. Look at those stinky, stinky toes. Oh, those are so stinky. Okay guys, so Graceland just woke up.
<laughs> Hi, baby. How was your nap? Did you wake up and then fall back asleep on the couch? Yeah. You did. You did. Are you ready to be up now? Come here. Come to mama. She took a nap when we got home while we were doing the chairs. She went down for a nap. And then she woke up and my mom was getting ready to leave. And I was nursing her and she was like falling back asleep. So I was like, okay, like I guess she wants to go back to sleep. So she just fell back asleep on the couch for like, I don't know, 20 minutes. And now she's just like, bam, up. She is ready to take on the world right now. Are you awake? You fucking crazy. Oh, really? Really? Yeah. What? Do you want to see the table? Mommy finished the table. <gasps> Let's go see the table. Let's go see it. Come on. I did finish the table. I got it all finished. It is all set right now. And ah, there it is. This is just what it looks like. And obviously all of the chairs were painted black. They were black before, but now they're just like a just all black color. I did end up going with this like gray, light, light, like lightish gray. It kind of has streaks of like dark gray fabric in it. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. So this is just what the table looks like. I really like it. Don't lean on that, please. I still do want to get like some cute placemats to go right here too, um, because I think that would be super cute, so. Yes, that is the dining room table, right? Somebody's in a cranky, cranky mood. I'm making some tacos, and I have the world's crankiest baby girl right here. She is just throwing a fit no matter what I do. I can't really distract her right now. So she might be a distraction to me cooking, but we're going to try our best. <laughs> Strong onions. I love onions. Onions are literally my life. I love every type of onion that could ever possibly come into my life. I just love onions. Okay. I just simply love onions. I just onions are everything to me. And onions mean a lot to me because onions are so good. <laughs> amazing like it turned out way better than I thought what even is my hair right now first of all that was seriously so much better than I was anticipating it to be like it tasted really good so I'm pretty happy with how that turned out um, I just cleaned the entire kitchen well not the entire kitchen but I have all my dishes right there drying and then I wiped the counters wiped the stove I did sweep the floor I want to clean my floor with my new cleaner but I think I'm gonna wait till she goes to bed because it's gonna be impossible with her because she just wants to sit in this corner and play with her socks um, and I can't get her to move so we're just gonna let her do her thing but everything is great everything is awesome I love having my own apartment it's awesome literally like I'm so in love being here I just I love it this is awesome like I don't know I just I'm loving this I'm loving it